Parents know that kids who don't get enough sleep can get cranky, but Consumer Reports says new evidence suggests that a lack of sleep in kids may also be linked to several very real health problems, including type 2 diabetes. Their health experts have some simple tips for guiding your kids on a path to wellness. Valley News Team's Lisa Badeau has our story. After looking at the sleeping patterns of close to 5,000 9- and 10-year-olds, a new study published in the journal Pediatrics concluded that sleep deprivation could be linked to some serious health issues. Kids between 6 and 12 years old should really be getting between 9 and 12 hours of sleep per night. Younger kids should get even more. The children in the study slept an average of 10 and a half hours a night. But researchers found that for every extra hour of sleep the kids got, risk factors for type 2 diabetes, such as body mass index, body fat, insulin resistance, and glucose levels, all went down. It doesn't prove a direct correlation, but it does suggest a connection. So researchers and parents, frankly, need to be looking at this more closely. Over the past 15 years, there has been growing evidence that children and adolescents are getting less and less sleep while well, type 2 diabetes is becoming more and more common in young people. Consumer Reports says parents can encourage healthy sleeping habits from an early age by limiting screen time before bed, keeping bedtime routines consistent, and avoiding caffeine. Things like pop, energy drinks, and even chocolate can be problematic, especially later in the day. Simple interventions, which could help kids avoid some serious health consequences. Lisa Badeau, Valley News Live. Wondering if your child might be sleep deprived? Some warning signs include falling asleep in the car frequently, having a hard time waking up for school, actually unusually irritable, aggressive or emotional, or being easily distracted. I think I qualified for several of those. <laughs> Sounds like most of my uh, teenagers and 20s. Um, well, we've got a, a lot to look forward to in Bison football this weekend. Uh, but first, NDSU men's basketball. Another tough road test uh, down south. we got highlights from this one coming up next.